What is going on guys? Grave here today. I want to talk about what keeps you playing the Elder Scrolls online. And the reason that I kind of wanted to make this video is I've been asked lately, you know, what keeps me playing after, you know, playing this on consoles since 2015. Uh, what keeps me playing, you know, considering the CP is changing. A lot of people I think are worried about that, you know, with update 29. We get this update here on console next week and a lot of people have asked me, you know, what CP are you? A lot of people, I guess, figure since I've played so long that I should be almost 3,600. That's definitely not the case. I'm only like barely into the 900s. And, you know, then I, when I tell people that, I've had also, you know, some folks say, well, why would you continue to play? You know, that's a lot of grinding. Why would you continue to do it? And the whole reason is, it's really because when it changed a few years back to 810 CP, when actually the CP, you know, kind of got up to 810, I got to 810 and then just kind of decided to quit grinding out, you know, CP levels. I started doing housing. I started crafting furniture. I started getting into, you know, selling things and making gold in game. I started doing a lot of other stuff, just kind of adventuring around and having fun and, and just enjoying the game for what it is, you know, uh, something besides just, you know, just kind of a, a CP grind. So that is one thing to me that really is fun about this new update is I'm not really worried about the CP, you know, 3,600. I'll get there when I get there. Um, I, I've enjoyed the game for this long and, you know, yeah, I was 810 for a long time, but now that uh, it, it's gotten to this point where we can grind more CP, it's something for me to look forward to doing because there's a lot of different things in game that you can enjoy. You can enjoy the combat system. That keeps a lot of people playing. Whether you're someone that's out there, uh, you know, pushing some crazy scores and, and trials and vet trials and things like that, uh, doing no death runs, all that kind of stuff. You know, you can enjoy the combat system. If you're someone that maybe not is, is not as great at weaving, but you still enjoy all the different abilities and how they tie together, guess what? You can still enjoy the combat system. Uh, you may enjoy the lore of the game. You may enjoy uh, theory crafting your own builds. You may enjoy trying to make a hybrid build. Whatever the case may be, there's a lot of reasons for people to continue to play this game day in and day out, year after year. Also, housing. Housing has become a thing that is absolutely massive. And I hope one day we have a housing 2.0 update where we get some new things added in. Uh, I think, like, like I've said in the past, I think a lot of people consider uh, housing to be an in-game activity. There's a lot of in-game players that do housing, maybe instead of trials or whatever the case may be. Um, but you do have those fans of trials and, and, and vet dungeons that like to do you know, the new dungeons on hard mode and unlock skins and things like that. There are so many reasons why people keep playing this game is not funny. So... I guess when someone asks, what keeps the community playing? What keeps me playing personally? There's a lot of different answers. You can still go into even more things like this, the friends you have made maybe in guilds or maybe the friends that you started playing the game with. Uh, maybe the guild that you're in. You've met new people that you enjoy talking to or, or you know, playing the game with. Uh, maybe you just like exploring and looking at the zones. Some people have done a great job with being in some of these zones and taking some amazing screenshots, whether it be on console or PC, just some of the beauty of the game. And last but not least, some people may just say they have a lot of time invested in it. I think a lot of people feel like that as well. You know, I have a lot of time invested in it. I enjoy it. I enjoy all the things that I've talked about uh, here in the video and even more things probably that I haven't even talked about. But overall, I, I think it's a game that has a lot to offer for a lot of people. And that's the reason I keep playing personally. I'm not sure about everyone else in the community. I'm sure everyone has their own reason. But just to kind of list off some things, like I said, those things I talked about are things that I hear a lot of people discuss of why they like the game. And like I said, just because maybe you're not max CP yet, maybe you're still leveling up, maybe you just started, maybe you're only 500 CP, or maybe you're a little higher than me and you're maybe close to 2,000 CP. No matter what it is, the new CP grind is going to give us all something to do. But all the other stuff that we enjoy about the game is still going to be here. So if you don't want to grind out CP and you're not worried about getting to top CP in a hurry, you still got lots of things to do in game that... We've enjoyed for years and years and will continue to enjoy, uh, enjoy for years and years. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you like about the Elder Scrolls Online and why you continue to play it. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.